Hey, welcome to Breakthrough Science. Benjamin here. I'm in the beautiful state of Kerala in India and right now doing my holidays here, but I didn't want to miss the opportunity to talk a little bit about a recent publication about malaria. As you all know, malaria is spread by mosquitoes and here they are just everywhere. Mosquitoes are far spread around the world, but especially in the tropical area they can cause some severe sicknesses. Malaria, dengue fever and chikungunya, sorry I always struggle with that one, are far spread here in Kerala in India. Most of these sicknesses can be treated well, but the people who are really concerned with them, the locals, often can't afford this treatment. In 2017, there were 216 million cases of malaria and 400,000 of them ended with the death of the patient. Malaria, as said before, is mainly a problem of the poor because they can't afford a proper treatment. Also one problem is that the overuse of certain drugs makes them inefficient to malaria. A recent publication showed a solution for that. A commonly used blue dye helps to prevent the infectious phase of malaria. Normally malaria is seven days infectious and this is often before you show any symptoms. This blue dye together with an other drug, an anti-malaria drug, can reduce the time to two days, which would help to prevent the spreading in the first place. This paper was published in Lancet Infectious Diseases. And a test group of male individuals between 5 and 50 years was observed. All of them had malaria in their blood, but they didn't show any symptoms yet and they didn't receive any treatment. Nevertheless, they would have been infectious. After all, these news are not entirely novel. The first publication about methylene blue as a treatment for malaria was published as early as 1892. Nevertheless, it didn't lift off. And this is mainly because the missing opportunity to patent it, it's already far spread, and the blue dyeing of urine and feces. Let's see if this recent publication gives a new spin to the topic. This was Breakthrough Science with Benjamin and I hope to see you all in the next session which is about the origin of life. Stay tuned, stay curious, see you guys, bye bye.